everybody. My name is Bubby. Everyone say hi, Bubby. So good to see all of you. And as you know, when you come over to Bubby's house, we sing a song. Ready? I'm going to sing and you repeat. Welcome to Bubby's house. Welcome to Bobby's house. Come on in, let's have some fun. Oh, good job, you're all such lovely singers. Oh, I'm so excited. You know why? Today I'm making challah with my sister Harriet. So let's roll the tape. Hi, everybody. Oh, it's so nice to see all of you. I'm here with my sister. This is Harriet Hamidashin. Everyone say hi, Harriet. Oh, we're so excited because as you know, it's Shabbat and we're making challah today. So Harriet, um, how do we make challah? What are you putting in there? Well, first, before we do this, we put in some yeast and some honey. Oh. And the yeast starts to get bubbly. Oh, like it's alive. Mm -hmm. It's alive. It's alive. Okay, Bobby. Uh, so then this is a little bit of saffron. Saffron. It, oh, interesting. It just gives the hala some color. Oh, nice red color. Yeah. We need to measure some more flour. Okay, measure some more flour. So we need to. That's a lot of flour. Here, it's a lot of flour. Because as you know, challah is a bread. It's a bread that's very eggy. And you know, I think we have something here that we're about to use yeah. to make it eggy. Righty, three more eggs, did you say? Yes. Three? Three, please. All right. Well, we need to wait for this yeast to get a little more bubbly. So, um, in the meantime, I'm going to ask my sister Harriet some questions, okay? And what's your favorite animal, Harriet? I like doggies. Oh, I love doggies. Oh, my goodness. And you have a doggy, right? What's your doggy's name? Her name's Mitzi. Mitzi? Oh, my gosh. Everyone, bark like a dog. Ready? Ruff, ruff. Good job, Ness. Pant like a dog. <laughs> Good job, everybody. Oh, and my dog's over here. Jump up. Come on. Oh, see, this is bad behavior, but we'll allow it because she is very cute. What is your favorite thing to do at home? My favorite thing to do is to knit. Knitting? Oh, wow. You know, I never got into knitting. It's very, um... Strange that I didn't, but I'm more of a crocheter myself. Well, um, do we think this yeast is ready? Yes, but first, Bubby, I have to go wash my hands because of the doggy. Oh, that's true. We have to wash our hands whenever we touch something else before we touch our food, okay? So we'll be right back. We're going to wash our hands. Everyone, wash your hands. Now that we've washed our hands, we're ready. The yeast is all bubbly, so we're going to add the flour, right, Harriet? Okay, add the flour, and, and Harriet's going to be stirring. Everyone stir you in your bowl, stir the flour. Okay, do you have to do it slowly, Harriet? Slowly, stirring, stirring, No, I meant stirring. the flour, silly. Do you add it slowly? Yes. Oh, no, slow, okay, slow. I'll add it slow. Okay, stop now. I did. I did. Okay, let's put some eggs in. Oh, so you make a little, can you show them? You make a little circle in the middle and you add an egg into the circle. We do. All right. Uh, do you trust me? I do. Go ahead. All right. Whoa. Add one egg. Okay. How many eggs do we need? One more. One more? Oh, only one more? You only need two? No. Oh, how many eggs do you need? Four eggs. Four? Oh my goodness, four eggs. Uh, are you ready for the for the third egg? Yes. Third egg. Egg number three, you ready? Yes. There we go, third egg. You need one more? One more egg. One more egg. Alrighty, you ready? Ready. Okay. Wow. Oh, okay. There we go. Now we need some oil. Oil. Ah, okay. okay. Where's the oil? Here's some oil. You know, I actually need to wash my hands now because I got egg on them. Okay. Got egg on my hands. And wash your All hands. Right. You keep stirring. I'm stirring. 
during the hala, during the hala. Hala is for stirring. Hala is for stirring. Bobby better come back soon because I'm not a good singer. But I'm a good stirrer. I need two of these quarter cups. Two quarter cups? Of oil. Oh. Well, one might say that's a half cup. Wouldn't one? Would one or not? <laughs> would one not do that? <laughs> one would, but I, but I didn't. <laughs> oh, we always have fun, me and Harriet. What was your favorite memory of us growing up? Well, it was when you taught me how to make a kugel. Oh, yes, I do make a very good kugel. Maybe next we'll do that. Maybe. That'd be fun. Next, maybe next Sabbath. Yes. Yes. Now what? We stir it until it gets ready to go into a ball. Ah. It'll be soon. And then you bounce it like a bouncy ball? Face. No, you don't. No? Don't bounce it like a basketball. Do you throw it like a basketball? No, you don't throw it like a basketball. Do you hit it like a baseball? <laughs> no. You need it like a ball of dough. Oh, that makes more sense. You know, it's all mixed. Ooh, that looks fun. It's really fun. This is a fun thing to it's do at home with your, with your parents or your bubby. Mm -hmm. How long do you have to knead this for? Many, many minutes. Knead it and knead it. Knead it. Wow. Is that all the kneading? No. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. It's all right. Five hours later. All right, so now it's been resting for how many minutes, Harriet? Ten minutes. Ten minutes, and now we're going to braid it. Yep, we divide it in half. Oh. So we're going to make... Half? What does that mean? Well, here's a, the whole ball uh -huh. of pala, and then we, we're going to pinch it in the middle. Whoa. And make two balls. Oh, so half is like you take one thing and you make it into two things. Right. Now, we're going to take one thing uh -huh. and make it into three things. Wow. First, we're going to stretch it out a little bit. Ooh, stretchy. Dough is very stretchy and it's mm -hmm. fun to play with. It is. So then we're going to make it into oh. pieces. It's fun to experiment in the kitchen. Into, okay. Uh -huh. We now have three. Oh, I see. see. Yeah. So then we're going to take each one and uh -huh. we're going to make it long. Ooh, kind of skinny. I see. Mm -hmm. Like a long S hair. Or a, like a snake. Wow. Oh. Rope. Everyone pretend you're a snake with me. Go. Now we have two. And now we have one more. One and one. And another one is 300. No. No. 33. No. Uh, 3,000. No. No. Oh, it's one, 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 one. one is obviously four. No, look. look. Oh, you're right, three. One, oh, two, three. three. Oh, dear. So we take the three ends uh -huh. and we're going to put them together. Oh, at the top? At the top. Interesting. Then we're going to take one side and go over another. Oh, and so it goes in the middle. we take this one that goes over here. Oh, wow, that one goes in the middle. And then this one goes in the middle. That's great. Oh, they all and just then go in the middle. this one goes in the middle. And then this one goes in the middle. And then this one goes in the middle, and then we we pinch the ends. Oh. Okay? And now what? And now we let it rest some more because it's worked really hard. Oh, I can relate. <laughs> we cover it up with the towel. We cover it. So it can take its nap. Oh, that's cute. And then we come back in an hour. An hour? And then oh, we bake dear. it in the oven. All right, I so guess we have to be back. patient. That's right. All right. So after it's nap, mm -hmm. then we'll come back and we'll put it in the All oven. right, everyone, go for a nap. Ready? And look, now we have some hollow. Oh, my goodness, I'm so happy. We just put it in the oven for... Harriet, 
How long do we put it in the oven for? One hour here. One hour. Just put it in the oven for one whole hour and then look at this beautiful challah. It's so nice and braided. I may have already eaten some of it. Ooh. But then you just take a nice chunk of it and dig in. And that's how you make challah. Oh my goodness, I'm so happy that you all joined us today, my friends. And as you know, when we say goodbye, we always sing our goodbye song. Okay, ready? It goes like this. Shalom, farewell. I'll read us in goodbye. Goodbye. Your turn. And we all sing together. Goodbye. Goodbye, everybody. Shabbat shalom. Thank you.